Hey. All right, guys. Uh, uh, I'm pleased we're here today. I know this may not be um, that easy for both of you for for different reasons, but we've got to get through this. The more positive we can stay, the easier it's going to be. We've got got some confrontational barriers, but you know we can we can do this. So, uh, would both of you like to tell me in your own time why you're here today? Well, me as a frog, I'm absolutely in love with the lemonade. I love looking at it, and I think in some ways the lemonade looks at me. Lovingly, I hope. And um, I'm a um, lemonade bottle, and uh, you're just talking to me, really. Okay, um, lemonade bottle. Uh, uh, in resp Is there any ways that you, you might have a positive or encouraging response to uh, the frog's um, I expressed interest in you? I think um, love's a great thing and I think if someone wants to look at me then that's fine. I have no problem with someone giving me a fixed gaze but um, I just hope that the frog can understand that I can't completely commit to that all, all the time. Okay, okay. So... Uh, you're you're a sort of free spirit, I suppose. You, but I don't I don't want to put words into your mouth. But um, yeah, how am I free spirit? It well, as as a as a suggestion, in that was the impression I got anyway. I don't know what the frog got from your your past statement. Why well, do you know what you're talking about? The frog. Uh, <laughs> well, <laughs> let me just let okay. Few communication barriers here. We'll just sort of um, varnish them over. <clears throat> now I'll get back to that in a minute. First of all, I just want to carry on in this sort of rate we're progressing. So, Frog, um, uh, how how deeply do you, do you feel uh, in regards to uh, the interests you expressed earlier of, of the lemonade? Can you repeat the question, please? How deeply do you feel the things you were telling me earlier? How how sincerely did you mean it? You know. Um. Can I just ask you what what is this? I mean, what are you asking me? I mean, what, is it any of your business? Not really. No, it's it's none of my business at all. But uh, I it's my job to be inquisitive. Uh. And uh, can you please look at me, please? I'm looking at you. I well, at least I thought I was looking at you. Hello. Okay. Hi. Hello. Hey. Yeah. Okay. So, <laughs> excuse me. I just I just remembered a joke my friend told me last night. It was utterly hilarious. But I'll tell you. I'll tell you at the end. It'll be a nice little anecdote to, to our to our to our problems here. To, to our obstacles. Um, so, uh, in regards to, to what's just happened, uh, the only way I can kind of bring bring this a step forward is to ask um, how specifically, uh, I'll ask you first, Frog, how specifically does your feelings for lemonade um, affect affect your life? How does it affect you? Well, loving someone that doesn't love you is very difficult. Of course it is. I'm not going to deny it. And in some ways, I feel at times maybe lemonade has led me on a little bit. I don't think I've led you on at all. And to be frank, I think we have to be a bit real in life sometimes. I know you're a very spiritual frog, but sometimes you just can't stay in the same spot. You can't just look at the same things all the time. If you look at me, I have no face. I am a circular face. I look everywhere. My eyes are everywhere. There is no fixed point. Perhaps you could do well if you start looking at other people other than me. Open your mind up a little bit. Well, as usual, your words, they mean a lot to me and just speak in a little sense. But I can't help the way I feel. This is very interesting. So, um, 
obviously uh, the initial impression I got uh, from what you were saying there, Renee, um, was to do with you know your outlook on life and the fact that you are obviously very you're not a frog you know you're not a frog um, and everything about the way you're shaped and, and your very nature will will have some effect on you know your your differing your differences between the frog um, but in that same light frog what how could you maybe take this opportunity to very briefly explain explain to them and uh, uh the way you see it from the point of view of being a frog, from being a frog that that likes to stare a lot and likes to fixate on on certain things. H and how does how would you explain, say, to to an alien from another planet what it's like to be a frog? I would say to an alien, take a bit of time to cry. And once you cry, you will then understand that really, things aren't so bad. Lemonade, would you agree with this at all? I think the frog is a wonderful character. He's been around since the 90s, and ever since he was on this earth, I think he's been staring, and he's remained staring. I just happen to be in his place. Whatever he sees, he loves. But he'll love someone else. He will. Right, okay, I see. Frog, do you, do you acknowledge that, that you'll love someone else? I know I'll never love you. Me? Yes, you. I will never love you. You're a sad bitter man this is true this is true but you see it's it's all role playing you know life is just one big role play i mean one moment here i am sat here talking to a frog and lemonade the next moment i'm i'm buying sliced bread in sainsbury's you know how how can martin there are laws there are laws that you must abide You'll go to prison if you don't follow those laws. If you believe you're free, oh, you are not. Yeah, yeah. No, 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 well... Yeah, they're going to laugh at you, Martin. They'll laugh at you. Who's going to laugh at me, specifically? The people that see that you really are not in touch with reality. Well, I'm not sure about that, really, because... It's like you were just saying, you don't understand how it is to see the world as a lemonade bottle, and, and the frog tried to express some... Do you never look at the eyes? Well, you you have, in all fairness, had your eyes fixated on, on the lemonade bottle for well, quite a long time. You can look at me, though, can you? You can look at me. Well, yes, but as you said... Just you're... look at me. I'm looking at you. Thank you. Yeah. It's no problem. But, you know, eyes... Visual is only one form of communication, even doesn't matter whether you're a person or a lemonade bottle or a frog or a badger. People, things need to appreciate um, All right, Martin. different circumstances. How you doing, man? Oh, you're right there. How you doing? Yeah. What are you up to? Uh, not much, really. I'm just uh, planning some like, stuff <laughs> tomorrow, you know, how it is. All right. Uh, well, you know, when you're in time, man. When you're in time. Yeah, no worries, no it's worries. Nice, totally. Nice little, nice little uh, thing you got here. Yeah, yeah. My uh, my housemate stuck that together for me. She um, she likes lemonade and frogs. Cool. Yeah. Oh no, I was just wondering. Is it right if I borrow um, um, some of your wires? Wires. Oh yeah, yeah. Just catch over here. That, yeah, yeah. Sure. Go for it. Go for it. Cool. Nice going alright. Yeah. Catch you there. Okay, I'm sorry about that. Um, Brett and mine, yeah, anyway. Um, I didn't want to break that whole train of thought, so we'll just pick it up uh, from a more basic point now. Um, so I understand, even even if you guys are having difficulties seeing eye to eye with me, pardon the pun and everything, um, at least 
if you can try and see eye to eye with each other, I can I can tick that off my kind of list of things that I need to get done today. Um, which is for my own gain, I, obviously, I will admit, but you know, I am here to respond to your well-being really. My well-being at this moment of time is yours. Um, you obviously both care for one another in one respect or another. There are differences, you know, Frog, you're still quite fixated on the lemonade bottle. Um, and lemonade, I, I don't know what to suggest in as much as you're... Well, I think we feel a lot better because you're looking at us in the eyes now. I feel you're treating us more as individuals. When you talk to me, you look at me now. When you talk to Frog, you, you look at Frog too. Yeah, you do. You're looking at me more. And I feel that makes a big difference for me. I can see you're both very visual sort of thinkers then. I mean, no, it's because we have eyes. We do have eyes, Martin. Well, that's true, but... You have to forgive me. I haven't noticed your eyes, Lemonade, but... um. I, I won't, I won't, I won't argue with that, because, because you know I respect you, and as as we've as we've made clear now, eye contact is obviously very important. So okay, well, there's nothing much more to talk about. Thanks for your help, Martin. Yeah, no, thank you very much. But um, let's just leave things, please. All right, it's a pleasure. Well, we'll pick up a bit later on, but yeah, for now, I hope you can take anything yes, I've okay, said. Fine. Okay, and forget anything that isn't useful. Thanks very much for your time, guys. I've got to go buy some bread. See you later.